We do a black history project every year that I've taught. And in the past, I've always chosen something that had to do with black history, whether it was uh, uh, African tribal art or um, something here. And these kids really enjoyed the self-portraits that the eighth graders did um, last semester. Pop art is all about popular culture and uh, icons. And I thought that that would be a great you know, way to introduce black history um, for each student to choose their own African-American, their own, you know, um, icon in African-American culture. And um, I had no idea some of the names that these students were coming up with. I mean, it was amazing that they got to choose who they wanted to do. And then we just uh, used very expressive color um, just as a as a mode of expression to complete their projects. In every project that I do, um, there's some sort of interdisciplinary um, cross-curricular studying going on because art is not just a pretty picture. It has to contain knowledge. And to be an artist, you have to know a little bit about every subject. So I'm always encouraging students to read and, you know, because I always tell them, if your head is empty, you have nothing to draw. You have to fill your head with knowledge. Well, we're doing African-American pop art portraits and we're using oil pastels and it really makes it colorful and it's pretty it's very vibrant and each of us are doing different ones but they all came out really cool and I did Whoopi Goldberg and um, a lot of African-American iconic figures. To say in math you have to have like everything right everybody has to get the same answer in art everybody can be different they can show who they are and what they like. Well it shows that Many people like African Americans. It shows that a lot of people are inspired by African Americans. It's like really fun to be in art. Like you always get to draw and show what you can do. That's what's so amazing about art is that everyone has something valid to offer in art because of just who they are as a person.